at this time of year, you try to step up in big games. It seems like Johnny does it a lot. Um, and, uh, you know, I had a huge goal tonight to get us going. Minnesota was not going to be easy going back there. Last year, the same thing. You guys went up 2-0, and then they took games 3 and 4. What do you expect from them in their home ice? Yeah, it's uh, it's something to look back and reflect on. Um, you know, very similar situation now. Uh, and it shows us that we can't be satisfied. We can't take the, uh, the foot off the gas here. And... Uh, um, um, you know, I know it's cliche, but if we can, uh, you know, go into the building and, uh, and make sure we're not satisfied here um, and worry about the next game, game three, obviously we did what we had to here at home, but, um, you know, we're not satisfied with the two wins. We want to uh, come back and make sure we have a good th- game three going into their building. Tough building to play in, um, great crowd. Um, it seems like they excel uh, um, pretty well on their ice, so it's uh, um, you know, something we got to be ready for. Hey, you, did you, did you hunch over at one point going into the... Bench, was, was there a scare at all, or did you did you feel something? Or? Um, no, it was nothing as far as related to uh, what's been injured before. Just uh, kind of got either slashed or, or speared there in the stomach, so kind of took my breath away a little bit. That was, that was really it. I was fine after a couple seconds. Did Can you, you feel- explain how, for basically a period and a half, there was not much going on, and then kind of an explosion there? Yeah, I thought we had some chances in the first uh, um, where we could have got on the board. Didn't really happen for us. The second, you know, sometimes you got to be patient against this team. It's something we've been stressing uh, ever since uh, we knew this was going to be our matchup. Um, you can be patient against them, and uh, um, you know, hopefully, you can turn good defense into offense. And obviously, um, you know, on a lot of our, on, on all three of our goals, uh, we did a, a great job of either turning the puck over and getting it up the ice, and. Uh, and getting a chance off it, so uh, we can stay patient like that. Try to build off uh, those opportunities. How hard is it for you to be patient? Well, I mean, it's so it's the way it's got to be, especially against a team like this. I don't think you're going to get many chances against them. They clog up the middle pretty well. Uh, got a good goaltender. It's uh, um, you know one of those things where you just got to stay with it, not get frustrated, and. Um, um, if you play the right way, I think eventually things will uh, kind of open up, whether we get them frustrated by playing good defense or if uh, you know, our, still, our skill and, and speed can take over. How do you explain it when a goal like yours opens things up after the first 40 minutes or just kind of more of a slog? Yeah, I mean, it was a timely goal. I think when you, when you get up 2 nothing, you know, going into the third period, they're going to press a little bit and, uh, and try to uh, um, create some chances uh, going back their way. So. I thought we did a good job for the most part of uh, you know keeping the chances limited there in the third, um, and uh, we made a great play in the neutral zone to get Sharpie that break. You made a great shot. Patrick, do you feel like you guys made the right adjustments from game one to game two, and that you could build on that from game three? Yeah, I think we could still get better um, in some areas. I don't think we're satisfied with where we're at. I don't think we played as well as we we can, but um, you know right now we're getting the job done, so that's exciting for us. Uh, and uh, I think all of us in here would agree there's uh, some certain levels to build off of. But when you look at who's producing right now, it seems like it's the core. You know, you guys are all stepping up. Is there some pride in that, just being able to do that this time of season? Yeah, I mean, we all have a lot of experience. And, uh, um, you know, we're, we've been in these situations before. So it's good to have, uh, you know, your top players step up and, and score some big goals. Um, and, uh, you know, we'll take some uh, some pride in that down the road. But I think... Uh, um, you know, it's one of those things where you kind of wipe the slate clean uh, after every game and try to uh, bring your best effort, if, if not even better, uh, going into the next one. Wild had some big rushes on, on Crawford. One came uh, right after a goal. How big was it? Yeah, he made uh, he made a huge, uh, I think, couple saves off rebound on Parisi in the second period there uh, when it was one nothing. And uh, if you look at that that, that moment there, it could be one uh, one. A couple minutes later, we come down and make it two nothing. So it's uh, it makes it a totally different game going into the third. And uh, he seemed like he was uh, he was solid tonight. I know the the crowd was behind him there, and uh, uh, he made some big saves, made some great plays with the puck too. So he's uh, he's looking confident, and uh, it's good to see.